doctor's awesome. Shout out to the doc. We 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 went skydiving. Shout out to the doc. Heck yeah, we went to uh, dinner a few I times. I want to know what kind of doctor is he. You know, <laughs> I mean, uh, come on, it can't take that long. He's probably the kind of doctor that has a billboard. No, he's not. Definitely not. What kind of doctor is he, Matt? I know you know. I mean, he's, you know, I, I, I don't know what kind of doctor he is. Never asked him that? I mean, you know, I don't, you know what? Listen, what am I supposed to say? Doctor well, Feelgood? I mean, I can ask him what kind of doctor. No, I mean, doctor I just thought, I good. thought you fucking knew. No. I do. What kind of doctor? Question mark. Read my super chats, bro. So anyway, what if he's a plastic surgeon and you never asked not. him what he is, or he does hair transplants? Because we would have come up. Huh. Because we talked about we talked about the hair. Maybe that's why he's giving you all this money to like seed that idea. Like, seed that. Ooh, idea. Let me go just, like spend this money back on the doctor and a little bit more. Huh? Like he does hair transplants. No, he doesn't. Do so hair. he's giving you this money. Doesn't so do you're going to go spend it back on him? No, no that, that wouldn't make any what? sense. I, don't understand. I think it makes like perfect splits. sense. I don't Doesn't understand that sense. logic. It yeah. makes perfect sense. <laughs> He's trying to recoup. When you think about it. <laughs> He's trying to recoup? You think, you think that's what, did he message you back yet? No. The doc. No, he's probably playing with his kids or on the computer. Or he's in the chat. I mean, he's, just, he's, he's, in, he's the in the chat, chat. watching he's, the podcast. So why didn't you ask him what kind of doctor? He's throwing money at you like you work at Mons Venus. Woo! <laughs> I'll show you. You throw <laughs> me enough. You put enough money. In. Yeah, I you, will. <laughs> people really want you to eat shit tonight, <laughs> huh? People want you to eat Danny's poop. That's what people are saying. That's been the main topic of it the is, chat. It is. It, you know, it's amazing That's how sick. how disgusting these fuckers are and cruel and mean they say not amazing. and cheap they say horrible things they want to see it they want all the action but they don't they want to want pay for action. it yeah that's not action that's disgusting depends on who you ask <clears throat> the internet's a weird place man fucking place place got weird when i was going <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck happened oh, what were we just talking about i fucking forgot <sighs> um Oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, okay, okay. It was argument. getting so, weird. The guy was oh, yeah. like, "Why would you admit to being a rat or being a soft white guy?" Yeah, he's going on. He, no, he didn't. He, had, he didn't actually say that. He just keeps going and going and going. He just keeps, you know. And I'm like, okay, well, you know, um, clearly we're we're cut from a different cloth. So I said, so anyway. And I'm like, do you want to keep talking about this? He's like, no. What I'm saying is this and this, and he's going on. And you know, I'm saying you with this, you with that. I'm like, yeah. He goes, so so you saying you're gonna get caught? <laughs> he goes, you're gonna get caught. You get caught doing something. No, first he said, it's your duty as a soldier or something along those lines. And I was like, soldier? He goes, yeah, like if you're a soldier and you get caught and they torture you, you got to hold out so you don't tell on your platoon. And I went, am, am I a soldier in this? <laughs> yeah, am right. I, I'm, a, I'm not a soldier. Have you ever seen the movie Batman? You ever heard of the Joker? Yeah, I'm not. I'm, That's I'm me. Not, I'm not, not, Bro, I'm taking, taking not holding. <laughs> I'm taking socias. Right. I don't know about soldiers. I mean, I, I, I just. It always kills me. These guys that are selling crack in the. They're selling crack in the park, you know, to pregnant women, and then they get caught, and you think that this guy's not going to tell on you, or he's going to hold strong. Nobody should tell on me. You. You're just a scumbag, bro. You're selling fucking crack. Yeah. And you're you're selling crack or you're kicking in people's doors or you're committing fraud or you're doing scams and you get caught and now you have principles. Yeah. <laughs> you're just a scumbag. Or someone else you gets caught this fucked now up you with decide you. to stand your ground on Now something. I'm going to you got to don't tell on me. I won't tell on you. Are you serious? That's the line. You're fucking ripping off little old ladies' pension funds. Yeah. What are you talking about? Yeah, but we're bros. Bros? Your, your bro's going to fuck your, your... There's no street code. Your bro's <laughs> going to fuck your girl when you're gone and take all your shit. Exactly. That's what's going to happen. He's taking your PlayStation. <laughs> right. right. And that's not, you know... So I'm, And I remember I said, I go, so I'm supposed to go to prison for 26 years? Yeah, and he was that. like, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, I'm not going to prison fun. for 26 years. I'm not doing it. Dude's playing Fortnite on your account, on your couch. His yeah, feet on your table. He's spending all your V bucks. I know a guy. <laughs> I know a guy earned. that got out of prison and told the guy to go to his go to my wife. Uh, he actually sets the guy up like you can stay. I talked to my wife. She'll let you stay in like the spare room until you get a job and get this and get that. Listen, two months later, he He's he calls. He calls. Room. He calls, and the wife says, "Don't call anymore. I'm with so and so now." The guy you set up in prison. 
to, to that your wife's going to help out, that you're going to help out. Your wife's been running with you for four or five years. Now he's fucking your wife. This is your buddy. That's what they're all. They're all scumbags. Yeah. Now, if you're a guy, if you're a guy and you're a stand up guy and you go to a pen. Now, I can understand you telling me I didn't say anything, not because I'm a good guy because you're not. But I didn't say anything because I was <clears> afraid <throat> that when I went to the went to the pen, they might kill me if I showed up with paperwork that right, said I yeah. snitched on right, everybody. Right, right, right. Okay, I got it. I understand you're going to a pen. You can't say anything. Mm -hmm. You know what it's like. Mm -hmm. You're going to a California pen. You're just fucking done. Right. I'll take the fucking 10 years. So, but the difference is that it's, it's that, or my family's in danger. I know that these guys will kill my family because I know they've killed my family before. But guess what? That's not me. Danny's, if I fucking told on Danny, he ain't killing nobody. No. Danny's not going to bust a grape. The worst Danny's going to do is sue me. He's ratting. That's it. And no, but I have a few people I could pay some money to that would really not make your life very pleasant. I mean, and I, I have a really good friend who I could pay about 500 bucks who, who would uh, I mean, burn your house down. What? <laughs> For five? I, a neurosurgeon. He's a neurosurgeon. A neurosurgeon. Sounds like what? He He's a hair. brain surgeon. I mean, I guess it's that's what. He's Holy saying. shit! No He's got so much damn money. I don't believe it. Prove it. Listen, he's got like. He, I, listen, he. If he could do brain his, surgery, he could do your hair transplant. That's for that's damn true. Damn his team. wife's car he's is like one hundred and fifty thousand um, dollar. Uh, was it like a, a Land Rover or something, or Range Rover or something? It was his wife's car. Wow. What's he driving? I I, I don't know. He was in, like in the shop or something. I forget. He's like, yes, yeah, Rari's in the shop. Picked it up. I was the like, Rari. It's always in the shop. So, yeah. So, yeah, that podcast did not go well. He was disgusted by me. This really broke my heart, too, because I thought we were going to be friends. Mm -hmm. But then he left. And when they were leaving, when he was leaving in a cameraman, the cameraman couldn't stop. Where did smiling. you guys film it at? In my hotel room. In, in your hotel room. Yeah, in downtown. It was the, uh, was, the was I say the Hilton? Hilton. Hilton uh, the airport? Checkers. No. Hilton oh. Checkers in downtown. It's a really nice hotel. So um, we do the whole thing. They gather all their stuff up. They go to leave. And when they're leaving, this cameraman never, he never, he couldn't stop smiling. <laughs> like he was just, he, this guy, and I kept saying, I go, boy, you're really upset about this. Well, I don't believe in that. I don't, I don't believe. I said, well, I understand you don't believe in it, but you know what happens. It so happen. Even after you stopped rolling, you guys were still talking about this? Oh yeah, he 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 stood up. He's packing up his stuff. I go, you really seem upset. I said it like five times during. Really, the I go, you really seem upset by this. Well, I just I just this. I I, I just don't feel uh, right. I, I I would not do that. I wouldn't do. It. So I understand. I understand. And he's like, you know, and even here's the problem is that when we were on film and we were arguing, we weren't really arguing because there was he was so animated. I thought there's a good chance this guy fucking swings on me. <laughs> and and, and I mean, let me let me be perfectly clear. If he had swung on me, I wouldn't have survived it. Right, I mean, right, right, this right, is right. a Big fucking guy. You'd have been yeah. calling the neuro doctor. <laughs> yeah, he, would, he, would have to he couldn't have helped. The doctor couldn't have helped. I mean, so I'm sitting there. So he's making these ridiculous, giving me these ridiculous scenarios. What's the doctor saying? Um, what did he say? He said, you're an asshole for not telling me you were going to be on the podcast. Yeah, why wouldn't you tell him? I didn't tell him because... Well, I don't have to fucking tell him this. I can tell him right now. I didn't say anything because I... Why didn't I? I didn't really. Oh, no, Why didn't you? Did. You told me yesterday. Yes. I literally I told you Monday, until I think. earlier. I forgot I think until Monday we today. decided I like, to do this. I got to do like a Nanny's podcast. Huh? I think Monday we decided to do this. Monday or Tuesday. I believe, uh -huh. I believe it was Monday night. Well, he was knows. He I told Luke right, right after. I forgot. On. I forgot. What, what it, I He's forgot. a busy guy. He's flying to LA and shit. Yeah, He's yeah, on yeah. Vice now. Oh, you're on Vice now. Tell everybody how you did a fucking documentary for Vice. It wasn't a documentary. I'm an expert scammer. Yeah, you are on 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 Vice. So <laughs> I'm like one the of the John expert. Madden of scamming. <laughs> so I'm one of the. Listen, it was that was a pretty bad shoot. Like I mean, they had me doing all kinds of like. Okay, can you go? Would you mind looking out the windows? And I'm like, like through the blinds, and I go like some kind of peeper. Well, Vice, they like love shooting I, B roll. You know, like uh, just some yeah B roll. I said, oh, that's the fucking. I'm, I'll be a peeper. Let's do Hell this. Yeah. Come on. They, they did a documentary on Lanny Poffo, and he was telling me that they spent like two full days shooting B roll. Like him walking through the park, sitting at the on the bench, feeding pigeons. You don't understand. I'm only. They told me these things are like three or four minutes long. They're like you're literally only going to be on camera for a minute or two yeah. on, on three different episodes. It took six hours. Yeah. Damn. 
So that's yeah. professional. So listen, when the cameraman's like leaving, right? With matching cameras. And Thank you, Doc. Ooh. Hey, can your doc? Is he want, certified? Can he install the? Uh, can he install this? the yeah, Neuralink? I thought you had to watch fucking a game or you something. Got to go watch nine. TV. Got no, we got uh, the NBA, the last game of the season, the NBA Finals. Boy, I'm animated. Last what game? am I doing, bro? LeBron James versus the Miami Heat. I'm Hopefully all like fucking waving my arms and. S- <clears throat> Are you watching yourself? I just saw myself waving my arms. Get out of your head. Um, I forget what I was gonna say. You're just so in love with yourself. It's like when you look at yourself, you're just, oh, my God. What the fuck it's is me. this? Sky, what? It's Matt. Huh? Are you serious? What is this? All right. Should we wrap this up? By the insanity. Book. By it's insanity. This was the shortest Matt Pox, Matt Cox. <laughs> oh, here we go. Podcast we go. in Herbin's history. Kicking. Oh, the bourbon's <laughs> kicking oh in, God. kid. Oh, we're kicking. <laughs> Tell you what. Oh, check. Oh, okay. Everybody, thank you. <laughs> Matt Cox's PayPal is mattcox69 at gmail.com. Mattcox69. You can contribute to his hairline. He needs $7,000 for his next surgery, even though I think that hairline looks pretty good. It looks pretty solid to That's me. That's decent. Very it's, decent. I think it's better than my hairline. It's definitely better than, better mine. than mine. <clears throat> I've never seen a hair out of place on that beautiful head of yours. That's what 7K yeah, gets you, huh? The tan you even goes into the hair. The two of you. I mean, you guys are, I mean, with all three of you guys. Because it's, it's normally, like, when you get, you know, like, you get a really close fade, sometimes it's, like, white. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah, like, Your sunburn. tan goes all the way into your hair. Yeah. yeah. How looks, do you get that tan so perfect? And, like, in your hair. tan? You dye, you dye your hair? But your scalp is tan. I don't have a... So, no. are you 24-7 when you're out in public? Is your hair slicked back like that all the time whenever you go out? <coughs> I mean, I don't even know it was slicked back. I just put that. Well, you, you clearly yeah. gelled it back. I you did. don't wear a hat when I you just, pay for hair. No, I, no, like I don't wear a hat. I wear a hat because this is like a luxury. It's a, you know, it's just there. Like, if you pay for it. Well, you're so young and you have all your yeah, hair. Too. Yeah, I have. You have a thick head of hair. Wait, yeah. how, how would you think his, how do you grade his hairline? Oh, it's 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 amazing. He could, you, listen. Your hairline, his hairline is farther back than yours. He's got a good hairline. He's got a good hairline. Thank you. He could use a touch up. I, yeah, I, I, how do you little, think? A little scruffy. Do you think he needs a, a surgery? I, 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 not on the hairline, but maybe on the nose and the teeth. <laughs> <laughs> this would be wasted money up here. It's a bad investment. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta wait and see if it starts. No, but how do you get the tan? How do you get the tan so easy? I didn't even think I'm tan. Am I tan? No, like he was talking about how the tan perfectly hits the hairline. It even goes past it the goes hairline. It goes in. It like blends. You're, you're Probably because it's so thin, the sun hits my scalp. Mm. Could be it. Science. Science. Damn. <laughs> That's crazy. The solar, the UV solar rays. flares. Pen- the UV penetrates the, the hair transplants and hits the scalp <laughs> perfectly. Activates it. Activates it. <clears throat> oh, my God. All right. I yeah. think we've had enough. Yeah. Well, you got to go. Well, the game's starting. Well, we can watch the who's game. Who's winning? It. it hasn't even started. Well, who's going to win? The Heat. Is that who you want to win? Mm-hmm. You want the Heat to win? I only want the Heat to win because I bet him 20 bucks the Heat would win. And I really like Jimmy Jesus. Jimmy Jesus. <laughs> Jimmy Buckets? <laughs> Jimmy Buckets, a.k.a. Jimmy Jesus. They're the underdog, and I think they can come back 3-1 to one like LeBron did versus the Gold State Warriors in 2016. But I think LeBron's uh, – my my mind, my head's saying LeBron's going to win. My heart's saying Heat, please win. Huh. We'll see. There's some turmoil. But I'll probably lose 20 bucks. but thank God the neuro doctor donated about 5 hundo. Yeah. yeah. Thanks for the chicken fingers tonight, Doc. Yeah, yeah thanks, thanks, Doc. Thanks, We're Doc. eating chicken fingers. It's going to help pay for Matt Cox's dinner because I lumpy. always pay for Matt Cox's dinner at the podcast. Matt Cox, any last words? Uh, buy a book, and, buy a book. And, and sign and subscribe to my channel, Matt Cox, and uh, Inside, Inside True, True Crime. Crime. Books on Amazon. Books on Amazon. Danny's gonna put the put it in the link. Yeah, put, put the link for the put in the description. Fuck, bro, I'm so tired. Shark in the housing pool. Oh my god. Yeah, Jesus Christ, what a dude. You know, I know what a you know. Hold it up, hold it up so they can see. <laughs> you gotta Shark in the book. housing pool. <laughs> just throw a book at him. He just threw it. Shark in the housing pool, and it's insanity. Boom. Who just did this? Buy some shit. Buy it, motherfuckers.